one thing I think we can all agree on, whether you're an anime fan or not, if you like any type of show whatsoever, I'm willing to bet you hate spoilers. I don't know whether to call this an accidental spoiler or a slip up in the 4Kids W Yu-Gi-Oh! So let's go a slip up, let's give them the benefit of the doubt. I'm gonna play a clip from one of the most iconic scenes of the first season of Yu-Gi-Oh! And let's see if you can see what I mean. And I don't even know your name! I've been called many things through the ages. Pharaoh, Yu-Gi-Oh! I've been known as Nami. Well, Yami, I'm proud to call you my friend. Good, because I'm proud to be one. Notice anything? Well, you heard Atem say they call me Pharaoh, but at this point in time, he doesn't know he's the Pharaoh, not until he meets a Shizu in Season 2. If he already knew he was the Pharaoh, then this scene would have been completely unnecessary. There was one king who possessed a magic powerful enough to stop this evil threat. And who was this king? The Pharaoh who saved the world was you, Yami. And now the time has come for you to rescue mankind once again. Now, I call this a slip-up because in the original version, Atem doesn't call himself the Pharaoh. This was something inserted by four kids. They unwillingly gave us the biggest spoiler in Yu-Gi-Oh! history, and this is why I hate when they change lines from the original version. Which, four kids is famous for, we all know that. I'd like to hear your guys' thoughts. Would you call it a spoiler, a slip-up, do you think I'm wrong about the whole thing? Comment below, let me know what's on your mind. Anyways, if you liked the video and you want to see more, make sure to hit that like button. And if you're not already, make sure to subscribe to Anime Dude so you don't miss our next vid.